We are the 1975. Hello. Hello. 14 just started hanging out, playing. It was like a kind of school thing. No one else really played any music, so we sort of the thing is fell with into a band started, with each other. It wasn't, the thing is, with our band, it didn't start out like when you're 16 or 17 and you're like, oh, I want to be in a band for X, Y, and Z. It was kind of like playing music was an exciting model. Face Down, that first record we made, just a kind of ambient odd record des designated for for nowhere really we were just seeing whether people were we'd always fallen at the wayside a little bit always tried to catch up to major labels tried to be a band that we wanted to be and then tried to be a band that major labels wanted to be and with the first record we were like well let's truly truly try and express our creative vision and if people are into it, then people are into it. And, there's, and if they're not, they're not, who cares? The writing process isn't that much different in the way that it technically happens, but... I, I guess mean, we just do it on the road a lot more now road. do it in your bedroom. Exactly. From a personal place, I mean, obviously, as a band, as individuals, we're slightly more objectified now. We, we can't be, we can't really be as objective as we, um, yeah, that, that, that makes sense. I mean, we can't really, right from the same perspective that we had because things are different. Everything we do now, we know that people will hear it. So there's a certain kind of knowledge that kind of lies with you in that, but I don't think that it's anything to worry about because that first record, we just did it for fun. So people really loved it and we just need to keep doing that, I think. I'm Matthew. Hello. That's Ross. I'm Ross. <laughs> We're the 1975. Subscribe here.